really, really, really cool to see. And for it to be poking out of the leaf like that is absolutely amazing. So that is one of those special, special sightings. Now I can also see on the dam cam behind me that the elephants seem to be having a whale of a time down at Gari Dam. I just noticed now while I was looking at the microscope that they're all playing in the mud there and having a really good time and it's so warm this afternoon that it is the perfect temperature for elephants to be playing now you can see there we go look at that we've got babies lying in the mud they are really going crazy they're rolling around covering themselves full of mud and elephants will do this all just to keep their skin in good condition so it's going to cover themselves with lots and lots of mud and then later they'll go rub up on trees but look at that the whole family is getting involved it's not that often that you actually see the females in there with the young ones but the babies must be loving this this is like going to the pool or to the sea with your parents you can go and you can just get absolutely wild in the sort of water and around the edges and look at that on its back legs <laughs> So believe you're wondering how much an elephant eats in a day. Well, believe an elephant, depending on its size, will depend on how much it eats. So it eats between 4 and 6% of its body weight. In the summer months when foods are more nutritious, then it will be about 4%. But now as we go into winter and the grasses dry out and the leaves are not so full of nutrients, it will then go up to 6%. So that would mean in an adult female, she's probably eating about 200 kilograms of grass a day or food a day and in a big bull elephant can be as much as 300 which is really a crazy amount now interestingly enough i was talking to some people a few weeks ago that are studying elephants in the kruger park and they were telling me last year in the drought that those um, elephants were eating even more up to eight percent of their body weight because of how devoid the bush sort of nutrients was in, in the plants that they were eating which is really incredible that they had to then eat so much more and that's why we probably saw so much destruction last year and so little plant cover over the land they literally everything was being eaten by all of the animals as they were trying to find now we've just been bombarded by a bird did you see that, you see that? Yeah. a bird has just flown from our left hand side through the window which is right here <laughs> past ferg's head and out the other side of the tent so we have a extreme bird which is almost like a red bull race through here now for those of you who are not sure what i'm talking about a red bull race well there's these airplane races that red bull sponsors and they go flying through all of these sort of targets and barriers and all kinds of things and that's maybe what the birds are up to this afternoon 